Well, that explosion felt throughout Genesee County caught on this home security camera just blocks away in Flint. This is an update to breaking news. We first brought you last night. We just learned in the past hour, two people were taken to the hospital. A 70 year old died on the scene and a young child remains missing. At least three homes were on fire on Hogarth Avenue when first responders arrived on scene. At least 17 homes were impacted by that explosion. Hello everyone, thank you so much for joining us this noon. I'm Blake Keller. We certainly have a lot to get to. This was the chaotic scene just moments after the explosion in Flint around 930 last night. But just moments ago at a press conference, the city says the cause of the carnage still under investigation. We're still assessing the cause of this, this action, what happened last night. Things are under investigation. We have teams there uh, from the state police, the fire department, the police department, and we're still assessing and investigating what happened actually happened last night. Gas and electric services were shut off to the three destroyed homes. Service was shut off at four other damaged homes in the area. Consumers Energy says several homes in the neighborhood were surveyed, but no evidence of a gas leak has been found. The whole block was evacuated. We're assessing the homes that could have had structural damage, and we're assessing if it's safe for the families to go into the home to retrieve some of their personal items. United Way of Genesee County and Catholic Charities are offering assistance to anyone impacted. Stay with TV5 as we will continue to follow this developing story throughout the day.